Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. You know, um, if you... in fact, that is what I want to dwell on as we, mm. you know, we begin to go towards the end of the program. What must be done? Mm -hmm. What could be the solution to yeah. these crises? Why is President Akainde Ichilema failing on all fronts? Why? Uh, we haven't even discussed the issues of governance, no. where there is shrinking democratic space. Yeah. They are trying to steal the major political party in our country and give it to a stooge. They are abusing human yes. rights. Um, what, in your thoughts, what do you think Ambassador, should be done? Ambassador. And how can we get our citizens engaged? Yes. Ambassador, you know what I realize? Uh, when God wants to, you know, drop a, a man or destroy a man, mm. he first takes off your brains. <laughs> it's biblical, it's there. Londololé. When mm. God wants to, you know, take you down, mm. Mm. like, what happened to King Nebuchadnezzar? Mm, Nebuchadnezzar? Yes, at some point he lost his mind. Mm. So when you begin to lose your mind, you can make effective decisions. decisions. Uh, believe me, we have a problem here, a mm. very big problem. First, mm. um, they advocated, when we are changing the constitution, they advocated for a lean government. Mm -hmm. Do you know that the number of ministers cannot be equated to the number of managers in Zambia? Mm. Yes, mm. Zambia has more manpower mm. than this government. Mm. Okay? Mm. Mm. This came from the politics of no, we need to save, we need to do what? Mm. No. Secondly, there's a crisis in the Ministry of Mines. Yeah. Do you know why? Honorable mm. uh, Kabuswe is a political scientist. His degree, the, 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 his degree is in political mm. science. Mm. Mm. As though that is not good enough. He's permanent secretary. His degree is in... He was a lecturer at CBU teaching business courses. Mm. And mm. both of them are not, have nothing to do with mining except mm. <laughs> being, mm. being found on the copper belt at some point. Mm. Is that mm. a qualification? Mm. So these are some of the things that you start to see we why... Need to marry. Pick people on merit, yeah, marry the them to their competences. That's the thing. Mm. I mean, how do you get a tailor? Mm. Uh, you, you, you get a tailor. To run and, a butcher. I mean, you give them a butcher <laughs> boy. How? Yeah, give the yeah. tailor mm. the cross. And, and I am particularly concerned in the mining sector with the decisions that were made on KCM and Mopani. Yeah. On KCM, my worry is that uh, the investor in Vedanta is a rogue investor. Yeah. He was here for 20 years, mm -hmm. didn't pay taxes, accumulated mm -hmm. bills, bills and bills and loans on the assets of KCM. When government decided, because the investor was not uh, a good citizen, corporate citizen, to get him away, this government has brought back the same investor. Can you imagine? Who has now forced them to sign even a bar, far worse deal <laughs> than the first yes, one. The government agreement because he's, ref yeah, he's refusing to pay the old debts that KCM had accumulated when Vedanta was running and away, I think in excess of a billion dollars. It means Zesco, ZRA, NAPSA, will not be paid. and others will lose their money. Can this country afford for ZRA to lose to lose three, four hundred million dollars? Can not, this country not, not allow Zesco dollars. to lose three, four hundred million dollars? Can this country allow NAPSA to lose similar money? No. That is why Honorable Poker was well will not give you the contract. No matter how much we shout, give us that agreement you have between the CCM He's and... He's hiding. He's criminal. Is he going to go he's out with criminal. in 2026? Yeah, he's highly criminal. And Vedanta to date have not moved 
into uh, Luash. And Vedanta itself is, I was reading a story today, where they are doing a debt restructuring. Yeah, they are doing a debt restructuring. <laughs> and you know, they, they, they are trying to raise money um, to bring there. So how do you uh, bring an investor, a, an investor who is not facing ready? liquidation crisis? Not only that, you know, mm. in, in 20, that should have been 2018, mm. I was among the entourage which was sent to China mm. on a fact-finding mission. There was a Chinese company which was dealing with the, the, the Danta, which was dealing with KCM. Mm. So they were buying copper. And all our records were showing they were buying copper from KCM. Mm. And when the minerals reached there, the, that, the composition was that 40% used to be cobalt. Wow. 20% used to be nickel. Mm. And 40% used to be copper. Mm. And this Chinese raised the flag and said, come and see. Mm. So I was in that, uh, in that team. Entourage in China, yeah. Yes. Mm. With uh, means of mines, uh, I think even... Uh, then press aid, mm, uh, Amos Chanda, uh, Vaskazwe. Mm. We were quite a team. My BP shot up. Mm. I was shocked. Mm. We went and found the cobalt. Mm. And yet, KCM had no record, even in their returns, showing yeah. that they've been selling cobalt to yeah. China. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It is at that point that President. But that's what's happening to our mining sector. Yeah. They will not s smelt. They will send concentrates. Yeah, can you that imagine? way they can hide the gold, the nickel, the, the copper, the cobalt. The so copper is at seven thousand. Mm. Then was at seven thousand dollars a ton, mm. and the cobalt was at fifty eight thousand. My God, dollars yeah, it was at its highest at the time. Yes, and it was just now being missed in electric Forty percent of that, mm. and nickel was mm. way above thirty thousand mm. dollars. So can you imagine? People stealing daylight. Mm. That was the mm. reason, one of the reasons why uh, KCM was kicked out. Yeah. yeah. Now, uh, we got sold because I think uh, President Haga in the HLM with UPND, when they were raising funds for mm. their campaigns, mm. you remember there's a clip where is, uh, President ECO is saying, we had them. Mm. Mm. They, they were given $100,000. They said, no, Mm. who come and give you back your money. Mm. And they, so they were getting, they sold my rights, yeah. mineral rights in this country mm. before mm. they got in government. No, that deal doesn't make sense. So that's entanglement. And yeah. Uh, yeah. now look at uh, what they've done. Mm. They've given a tax holiday to mm. the mines. Mm. Okay? Mm. They're losing about $2 billion mm. every year. Mm. Mm. Now, for them to subsidize Miu Miu, they, lead, they need just about $700 million. Mm. Not mm. $2 billion. Mm. For them to subsidize fuel, mm. they also need not even a billion dollars. Mm. So if they were collecting this money, the $2 billion they've given to their friends in the mines because they helped mm. them when they were in the, in the opposition, mm. could have saved the price hikes that we've been experiencing. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. now, yeah. I think the challenge here for President... Uh, uh, why I even said he's only scored three out of seven. The challenge, maybe without concluding, I must also mention uh, the issue of uh, governance. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, what the police are doing? Mm -hmm. First of all, does you know? Does he know that police are finishing him? Oh yeah. 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 No, they have no idea. They are clapping. <laughs> You know, they are coming for us at, you know, that are on social media. The so-called praise singers are even happy. Yes, what do you need a rally for? Can you no imagine? need for a rally. No, but mm. what they need to know, and our mm. message in 2024, is mm. that rallies we shall have. Yes, yes. No, rally no, no. is a right. Nusamba cannot Let stop Let us see if Nusamba is going to shoot me over my rights. Yeah. 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 It's not yeah. a criminal mm. offense mm. assembling there. It's mm. not criminal. Mm. Mm. Even if we protest or we, 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 we hold a rally, mm -hmm. let us see if they're going to come and shoot us. Yeah, yeah. If yeah. they're saying they're going to arrest us, mm -hmm. time is ticking. We're remaining mm -hmm. with two years and they will be out. So, mm -hmm. to case Afuma, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. let them arrest us, to case Afuma. Yeah, and that's a call to Zambians. You know, the issues occurring in the patriotic front where uh, a, a known person held clearly an illegal conference. Can you imagine? Begins to call himself uh, PF president. Mouse, and yes. uh, And uh, uh, because it's a state house, state orchestrated, orchestrated project. Orchestrated project, yes. And state-sponsored project. They quickly recognize him at uh, 
ECZ, they kick out the leadership, our leadership in parliament, you know, and now they even want to stop us participating in by-elections, where they are saying only those at the <laughs> registrar should uh, uh, it's you know, funny. participate. It's funny. Even cleaning, we want, we've want. we recognized that there is a huge crisis. We want to clean. Cholera. They, they say, no, 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 registrar of society. Oh, my God. So, clearly, a lot of things have gone wrong in the governance sector. President Hakain Dechlema is fostering a dictatorship. Yeah. He literally wants want to erase the Mount Party state nature of our country. We are a democracy. In 1991, we decided to be a Mount Party democracy. And he's trying to erase this you know, by stealing and killing the patriotic front. You know, Ambassador, the patriotic front project, if I were in his team mm. as a minister or a national whatever management mm. member, I could have told him to leave this, this mm. project. Mm. It's, it's that snake Damaging called the Chiringari, Jiringaringa in Tonga. Mm. There's a snake which has two heads. Mm. So when it um, reaches where there's a tree mm. and it's going around the tree, it sees the other head and thinks that's another snake. <laughs> you know? And then it's quick at biting. So it quickly goes and bites the other head, mm. Mm. injects the venom. Mm. thinking this itself. head is dying mm. not knowing mm. that at the end of the day it will also die mm. that's what mm. this man is doing mm. you know he could have the clever politicians we had the Michael Satters mm. he told us stop talking about MMD anymore mm. go yeah. back to work yeah. they've elected us we don't need to be mm. you remember mm. and mm. what did it, we just saw people leaving the party going mm. to join PF mm. leaving MMD joining PF mm. eventually the, the, the MMD was in a, a share out mm, But mm. also, what is saddening is this thing where we are seeing judges living. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ambassador. You no, know, it's a big concern where the you know, Judicial Complaints Commission has been weaponized against the judiciary. Yeah. The security of tenure is not guaranteed and it's being used as a weapon to you know, beat them in line. You can imagine. As we begin to wind up, yeah. Yeah. what would be your your, your concluding remarks, especially uh, relating to the economy, what shall be done? Issues of governance, what should our people do? Yeah. Uh, it's very shocking. When I was analyzing the budget that they just passed, mm -hmm. I discovered uh, Ministry of Livestock and Ministry of Agriculture are lumped together. Mm -hmm. And they have something like 12%. Mm -hmm. So my worry was you have two ministries sharing a 12%. Yeah. Are you sure then we know what we want? Mm. There's no way this economy is not going to be revived if we cannot enhance Prioritize, production. Yeah, yeah, agriculture. Agriculture especially. production. Mm. And uh, sadly, it's so vivid. Mm. 2024 is a year of hunger, mm. coupled with uh, bad climate, and also the food reserves were tempered with. Mm. We exported. They exported. This sold. government exported and this exported. This selling and things, exported. you know. Mm. Uh, I don't know why the president loves the selling, selling, selling mm. of things. Mm. Eventually, uh, we, might, we have to be careful. Someone can just count our heads and ask someone so much <laughs> per head and we'll be sold. Yeah. 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 So, uh, um, going forward, this economy is uh, in shambles and it will continue being so. Mm. When PF left uh, uh, office, copper production was at 700 tons a year. Mm. Now it's at 300 tons. Mm. And mm. they have no plan on how mm. to raise it. They lied mm. to us that the taxes, the tax holidays to enhance production. Mm. But that's not the case. Mm. So going forward, this economy, for it to be improved, we need to enhance production. Mm. Cooking oil, we are still importing. Mm. Uh, honestly, mm. we should be importing a vegetable when, oil. When we had, uh, you know, brought about especially soya production. Yeah, it, so much. Mm. Again, we people were lied to. They were mm. lied to that there would be good market for soya beans, grow mm. soya beans. Then they grow soya beans, they are disappointed and left to suffer alone. Mm. I mean, it doesn't make sense. We should be importing machines and not mm. some of these other things. You know, um, going forward, mm. I don't see this economy improving because the 2023 budget mm. is the same as the 2024 budget. Mm. Mm. Then, 
Besides that, there is the, then they will only have one cycle of budget before going to elections. So 2025, mm. I don't know, maybe it will be also the same, and that mm. will be the end. Mm. So UPND has lost time. The first, you know, in governance, you create an impact. The first 90 days mm. of governance, mm. the first mm. three months, mm. what we, we up to now they, they are completing in terms of infrastructure was planned the first 90 days. Mm. What you know, we, we, we were enjoying the benefits, even the subsidies themselves came from what we did the first few months. Yeah. Now, they are remaining with two years, and uh, I don't know how they're going to employ those welders, I don't know how they're going to employ those wheelbarrow pushers, I don't know where they're, how they're going to employ my young brothers, mm. the bricklayers. Mm. If you say CDF, I mean, a project to the uh, tune of constructing, okay, let's say the, the, the hospital uh, in Kalundawalo mm. uh, had more than a thousand employees. Mm. We were class, a, four, a one by three classroom broke employee 1,000 people. It's no. not possible. Yeah. So they have to revisit everything. We mm. need a proper review. Mm. The debt restructuring, it's a mess. No, it's in a crisis. It's a mess. Mm. And all because of themselves. Mm. They mm. included clauses which were not acceptable mm. to, the, to, to the lenders. Mm. So that's why that's it flopped. Mm. China. China had three, about 3,000 companies in Zambia at a mm. time PF was leaving office. Now they have less, they are about 70, 60 something or so mm. that are still function. Mm. How, are you go, how would you eliminate a very important partner? Mm. Like China, mm. yeah. So all these things are not are telling us that this. So I'm not seeing hope in 20. No, I can't people. lie to people. Uh, mm. I'm seeing a, a further rise in poverty. Mm. From Chinga, it's likely to be from 82 to maybe 85. God mm. forbid, but they are going to play around the figures. There is this tradition mm. of you know manipulating figures. Mm. You saw it in the Auditor General's report. Yeah. Yes, yeah, CDF yeah. data there was manipulated. Mm. The FISIP uh, was data. not there. The mm. data was not there. Mm. But are they telling us that they did not no, audit the, CDF? They the did not audit doesn't go away. FISIP. The problem doesn't go away. But and, also to achieve like that. like we say, you can't do propaganda with the economy. No, no. Because our people will feel it. It's one plus one. <laughs> yeah, our people will feel it. Yes. <laughs> Honorable yeah. uh, 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 Malozo Schone, former minister, of um, Muchinga province and my minister in Eastern province and former member of parliament for 10 years. For yeah, sure, you sure. did a good job, by the way. No, thank you. Yeah, thank you. thank you for joining me in conversation today. It was an inaugural program. Um, for our viewers, we're discussing the multiple national crises that the country is going through, economic crisis, now to these uh, disease outbreaks that we have and just the social crises that our country are facing. Thank you for joining us, and we'll see you next time. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.